So many people live within unhappy circumstances, and yet will not take the initiative to change their situation because they're conditioned to a life of security, conformity, and conservatism, all of which may appear to give one peace of mind, but in reality nothing is more damaging to the adventurous spirit within a man than a secure future. The very basic core of a man's living spirit is his passion for adventure. The joy of life comes from our encounters with new experiences, and hence there is no greater joy than in having an endless changing horizon for each day to have a new and different sun. How important it is in life not necessarily to be strong, but to feel strong. To measure yourself at least once, to find yourself at least once in the most ancient of human conditions, facing the blind, deaf stone, alone with nothing to help you but your hands and your head. Deliberate living, conscious attention to the basics of life, and a constant attention to your immediate environment and its concerns. A job, a task, a book, anything requiring efficient concentration. Circumstance has no value. It is how one relates to the situation that has value. All true meaning resides in the personal relationship to a phenomenon. What it means to you. Tramping is too easy with all this money. My days were more exciting when I was penniless and had to forage around for my next meal. As for me, I've decided that I'm going to live this life for some time to come. The freedom and the simple beauty of it is just too good to pass up. Two years he walks the earth. No phone, no pool, no pets, no cigarettes. Ultimate freedom, an extremist, an aesthetic voyager whose home is the road. Escaped from Atlanta, thou shalt not return, cause the west is the best. And now after two rambling years comes the final and greatest adventure. The climactic battle to kill the false being within and victoriously conclude the spiritual revolution. Ten days and nights of freight trains and hitchhiking bring him to the great white north. No longer to be poisoned by civilization, he flees and walks alone upon the land to become lost in the wild. <laughs> 